Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Kristen with Faux Hair Fabulous, and I'm coming back today with another quick wig review. This wig that I am wearing is cow, it's by Forever Young, and it is a synthetic wig, and it is called Cowgirl Hot or Cowgirl Hot or Cowgirl Hout. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. I think it's Hot, and I did look it up on the uh, online dictionary and found out that Hot Hot Hout whatever means highly fashionable or uh, elegant, okay? So when you wear this thing, you're an elegant cowgirl, I guess. Cowgirl hoat, that's what it means. So anyway, take it for what it's worth. But this wig is pretty. I kind of had a problem with Forever Young wigs, especially in blonde, because I feel like they are more um, fake looking, kind of like Barbie doll hair. Not so much that they feel like Barbie doll hair, but that the color and it just, it's almost too perfect. So, you know, while this wig is not for me, I'm not going to keep this one. Um, I thought I would still do a review on it just so to give you guys an idea if you were interested or looking at it or um, interested in purchasing it. Uh, it's Like I said, it is synthetic. It is not heat resistant, but I was able to take the blow dryer um, on low heat and curl the bangs a little bit with a curling brush and it didn't cause any problems. So, when this wig came, it was very, very, very shiny. I did spray a ton of dry shampoo in it. And as you can see, it is still pretty glaringly shiny. It's just very bright. But some people like that. It doesn't have a root. It has one of those little fake skin top parts that is about an inch long. Um, you can't really part it any uh, different, any other direction up there because you will see, start seeing the tracks. Uh, this wig did come with a very heavy bang. It was thick. It was heavy. It was in my face like this. Uh, so I did uh, thin it out just a touch. And uh, like I said, blow dry just did the took the blow dryer to the bangs to um, give it some curl. Um, you can wear it in towards your face like this, or it can just be kind of um, brushed back. You could take the blow dryer and give it some movement to um, kind of take it off your face. Uh, the hairline on this thing is a typical wig hairline. <laughs> it's, you know, pretty blunt, but with the bangs, nobody's gonna notice. You can really see my uh, bio hair right there. So it's not really good for, you know, putting back, but that's why I think wearing it forward is best. You can do different things with the bangs. Um, let's see, it's a pretty long wig. I will show you all the directions here in just a second. Uh, let's see what else. It's a, I've uh, got my notes right at my side. Um, it's a, a closed lace cap. Uh, you know, this little skin part is just already there. It's, it was just on the top of the wig. So totally closed cap. Um, and then of course you have the open wefts in the back. Uh, it does not come with combs, but it has adjustable straps. So it fits just fine, and it will fit any size head, I believe. Um, let's see. That's about it. Other than the bang, the very thick bang and the color, you know, it's it's okay. It's an okay wig. I just, I had, uh, I did another review on a Forever Young wig before, and I thought it kind of looked wiggy and fake, too. Although I have ordered another one, it will be coming and uh, we'll see. If third time it looks wiggy and, you know, not cool, I'm not going to order anymore. So I just haven't really been that happy with my Forever Young wigs. So while this might not look great on me and I don't like it, um, it probably is going to look fabulous on you. So let me show you uh, the views from all sides and we'll cut the video. I probably should have stood back a lot further, but I'm not so excited about this wig. So this, I'm not feeling this wig review, but it might help somebody. So anyway, while I'm not a cowgirl either, I probably shouldn't even really be wearing this, but, and I don't have a cowboy hat to wear with my cowgirl hope wig, but 
a hat like this looks cute. And it might help it not look so fake. So if I decided to keep it, it'd be my hat wig. So anyway, I hope this video helped and stay tuned for more. We'll see you next time. Bye.